A special evening of music coming up this weekend to benefit a scholarship fund. Melody in the Mountains 2016 is coming up Saturday night. The concert will be held at Sullivan East High School. Here with more now are Jamie Fox and Brenda Davis. And it's great to have both of you on the show. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, getting ready for a big weekend, a great night of a lot of good music. So let's let's start, Jamie, by telling us, I understand this is your fourth year yes. in doing this. Yes, this is Very fourth, successful. Yeah. yeah, yeah, we've had good success doing it. Uh, it's a $2,000 scholarship. We've always funded it every year. As of May of this year, we've given away $8,000. That's wonderful. So, so and you guys time. sing together, so yes. tell me yes. a little bit about your group? Um, it's called Savior's Call. I've been with the group for 16 months. They've been together for about three years. Um, we'll be opening the show and then Deborah Perry and Jaden's Call will also be singing and she is a member of the former Perry's. They're out of Georgia. Okay. Uh, Southern Gospel Group. Great. And um, we also have Laura West who will be our MC and she's hilarious. Yeah, she's I mean, kind she's of a really, comedian, is she? I mean, is. she really is. She's, she's very funny. She's supposed to be very funny she and is. she really is she funny. Is. Uh -huh. Oh, good. And I know you guys have been doing this for several years and mm -hmm. a lot of people come back year after year. It's kind of a kind of a reunion, I understand. It is. It is. I actually, I first was in a talent show there, and um, the second year they had it, and so now I'm part of the group and <laughs> an organizer in it. So it's really become a real blessing for us. It's a, a way of giving back for his uh, uh, Chad's niece, who was in the group. Yeah, Jamie, tell me a little bit about the scholarship fund, and, and it's named after a special girl. Yes, it's named after uh, Haley Neal. She was a 17-year-old senior at Sullivan East High School. Uh, she passed away on April 29th. 2012, three weeks away from her graduation. Um, she had epilepsy, which was under control mm -hmm. at the time, and uh, she simply went to sleep one night and didn't wake up the next morning. And um, her family, after her death, you know, they were just looking for a way to remember her, to memorialize her, and uh, the scholarship fund was born out of that. And it makes perfect sense. You yeah. said a young singer. So loved music and to see these groups come together and of course at her high school and I'm sure you get a lot of support from the school as well. Yes, yes, the school has been incredible to let us use the facilities every year and yeah, they've all been very supportive. And a great way to remember somebody who was oh, yeah. died so young. Yes. And tell me a little bit about, you mentioned some of the music groups that come together. Is it different groups every year that participate? Yes, yes, we've actually had some of the top Southern Gospel groups. And in the last few years, the Kingsmen have been there, several groups, the Wiznets. Uh, Deborah Perry was actually there last year, and she's come back again this year. That's great. So. And very successful scholarship fund. You said you've yes. met your goal every year. Yes. Yeah. That is great. Yeah. And tell me a little bit about your group, the type of music you sing and the traveling that you do. We do Southern Gospel music. Mm -hmm. um, we're all very big fans of that. Um, this is our testimony to... to our faith in the Lord Jesus Christ and and we like to give back we this is not our full-time job we all have full-time jobs mm -hmm. and um, we sing at lots of different churches and functions and we just we just love to sing every one of us do and it's it's been a God thing for all of us our getting together so we really enjoy it it's it's wonderful and I know folks are really going to enjoy it if they come out Saturday night what do they need to do to go ahead and participate in the event uh, it's totally free uh, there is no admission charge. It starts at 6. All we do is take donations or actually pass a plate, I guess okay. you could say, take up an offering. And uh, that's what funds the scholarship. But the event is totally free. Just come out at 6 p.m. That'll be good to go. And I bet for her family it's very therapeutic to yes. sort of see the community come together to yes. support. Yeah, I believe it is also. I know her family quite well. And uh, I think this is a big help to them to remember her and to see some good. Yeah. come out of it because she she was very much looking forward to going to college and uh, this is very you know it's a way for them to remember her and to help somebody else every year in a positive way turning yes. tragedy into yeah. something yeah. something that helps others well we thank you both so much thank for coming you. on thank the show we know us. it's going to be a wonderful evening of music as they mentioned it is a free event and they will take up donations so that this can benefit the scholarship fund if you would like to take part it is saturday night it begins at six o'clock at sullivan east high school right there in bluff city it is melody of the mountains a fourth annual event